Now, it is actually a condition that we need to shut out Mario's team and win. So we'll try it again. But if we don't get a shutout and we just get a win, fine. I'll, I'll do it off screen. I don't even know if I'm getting all the Star Missions anyway. I mean, I don't know. Yeah, I know it's kind of boring playing the same speeding, but you know what? We get a chance for revenge. Waluigi, you know, I'm just going to have the same position for the last time. I might... I want a King Boo's to make a jumping catch, so... It might be easier to do for a second. Okay, that's fine. That'll be my change. Line up. Um, the same, you know what? I'll prove that that was just a fluke. That last game, yeah, that was just a fluke. This, this is... This is how good I really am at this game. Yeah, this is flower difficulty. The thing is, I'm not sure how much difficulty really affects like your hitting. Because I think it's really just how they can hit. Alright. The last game we let off perfectly. Hit home run. So even if we don't lead off that well this time, I'm not gonna, you know, give up. I'm just Ah! Just because our main goal is to get a shutout doesn't mean it's the end of the world. I do this one a little too late. Uh... Okay, PD, can you hit a home run again? So, like, where it actually, where it actually matters. Alright, that works, that works. Alright. Steal a run here with two outs. Yeah, I knew I could get into that. Right. One nothing. So we got one. That's that's good. So you're gonna win the shutout. That's all we need. All right. Nice curve right around the base, so you know, I'll do a hit and run with the back. You know, not gonna run. Could have dropped it, but he didn't. All right. Oh, the well, one thing in this game is still, I still have not gotten used to like how to control the outfielders. I mean, I know you press L to switch, and yeah, I don't like the fielders to be open. Right, I think I've kind of made that clear. But, uh, we get a double point, it means you gotta hit the ball. Oh, I'm gonna get one out, because he's a bit scared that I'd catch it, which kind of makes me self-conscious and think I was supposed to catch it. Oh, we still got it out. six years old, um, and aside from, like, the first time I've ever played a game, like, within a week, I was able to get it, and I can, like, play any game, you know, like, so I just don't get certain people, when you try to teach them to play games, and they just don't get certain things that are basic, even after you explain it to them a lot of times, um, 
for example, there's two common examples of this that I have. Number one, or three, I'll, I'll not three. Number one, in a racing game, use your goddamn items. That's why you get them. When you go run into the item boxes, whether it's Mario Kart, or Sonic, or the Diddy Kong Racing, which nobody would beat me at anyway, but that's just another example. But yeah, it's Mario Kart, or Sonic Racing, or whatever other racing game I may have had. There's, there's probably other examples that I don't think you know. Alright. Could score three here. Well, let's go for it. No, let's not. So, but I just don't get, so yeah, using items in a racing game, freaking recovering in Smash Bros. It's like, I'm like, this is how you recover, okay? This is how you jump. You can't do it. And these are, these are not all kids, even if they are kids. Like, I'm not saying, and like, uh, they're, they seem to be smart, like, in other things. So I just don't get why they can't do simple video game things. But also, in a game like this, move around in the batter's box. I don't want to have to pitch it down the middle every time just to, you know, have fun and not dominate you and strike you out every time. Uh, you have to learn how to move around in the batter's box. That could be gone. Yes! Alright, we've really kind of just broken it open this time. So I just don't get it. And if you're saying, oh, it's because you're used to these games, like, they, they, I feel like too many people can only play games that are realistic. And that's just really, uh, that just really doesn't work for me, because, like, you know, I have these cousins, I'm not going to say their names, but I, they play, like, Madden and stuff like that, and they can do fine with that, oh, but they can't play anything on Nintendo, because, you know, there's too much creativity in these games, so they can't just, they don't know what to do, they don't know what to do, even if I tell them repeatedly, you know, I'm not good at first-person shooters, but this would be like the equivalent of me not knowing how to reload my gun, if it had to be manual, I know most of them are automatic. But let's say you had to reload your gun manually. And there's a certain button you have to press to do that. That would be the equivalent of me not doing that. You know, like, they should at least, in, a, in this situation, I'll just stay with this situation, be able to move around in the batter's box, know how to do that, and maybe just, you know, if they still strike out, that's fine. I strike out a lot in this game, too. But, you know... It's like, and then, I, I kind of think Mario's Super Sluggers pandered to that, because, you know, there's the mode where you don't even have to move around in the batter's box. But, uh, whatever. Like, but, yeah, one of my biggest fears going into Super Sluggers was that it was going to try to be, uh, was that it was going to try to be Wii Sports Baseball. And, um, what's really weird is that that was actually one of the biggest criticisms of the game, or that it wasn't Wii Sports Baseball. Like, the fact that it was Waggle. Okay, here's the thing. Almost... Some games are better off Waggle, that's what you have to realize. But then again, I thought Zelda was better off Waggle, which it really isn't. But, like... I know I said I wasn't going to be talking about Mario Super Sword, but this is not me comparing it to this game. This is me defending it for something. That, you know what? Being able to move around in the batter's box and actually time it, that's fine if you want to use that as how you can hit the ball. Now, I don't think they executed it perfectly, but that's that doesn't have anything to do. They're saying the game, reviews are saying the game's not good because it doesn't matter how you swing the bat. You know, aside from, like, pulling it back and charging, it could be mapped to a button. Like, and that's the thing. A lot of Wii games, yeah, they could be mapped to buttons. But, you know what? It doesn't... Like, so what? That's that's not a bad thing. It's, it's kind of a pet peeve of mine. I have a lot of them, but... Uh, all right. I've been losing focus of this game. We got a one hitter going. We can very well get a shutout here. And then Monty Mole hit a double off of us last time, but he is just now because there'll be star chances. Hopefully down the way this inning. No. Okay. If you get under it. Good. Sorry, Noki, you cannot hit a home run. It's just not going to happen. All right, we need one out to get. Like I said, Noki's not going to hit a home run, so don't really have to be worried about that. Can hit one in the outfield, possibly a double, but... No, no, I didn't get a star. This is a star chance, so... Really, the only thing that can happen is... That's a hard hit. If there's ever a chance to get a ground out from right, 
That's actually a useless star chance, because he had five stars. The computer had five stars. And if I got it, well, I would have won. Like, right there. So, you know, I really don't uh, doubt that I'm going to win this game. It's just about getting those shutout, which there's actually quite a few shutout. Like, Waluigi went in a shutout. I think his was, he also had, like, beat Mario's team in a shutout. Thank goodness. That was a good play. That would have scored a run, too, with those Noki speeds. Alright. MVP. Good. Uh, let's see how he did. Oh, I wanted to see how he did, but we didn't. We are going to see our star improvement stuff. So. Oh, yeah. I win. I win. We didn't get anybody on our team. We, we're not really getting a lot of scout missions either that, or we're just not winning enough of them. Uh, while we just don't have one MVP, and Pitcher is the best uh, place to do it. Win with a shutout. Um, wait a minute. Okay, so you do have to, uh, be the Pitcher. Okay, that's good. So IGN lied to me. Um, but screw that for now. We're going to play somebody else, Magic Koopa is going to pitch, who will we play? Uh, let's play Yoshi's team. Well, we need to play Bowser Jr. every time this year. But on my team, we will die to Yeah, now we're going to... Okay. We can keep everything else the same. But I'm going to put Waluigi in the outfit. It might only be blue Magic Koopa, so just um, keep that in mind. Alright, let's go. Fine with the lineup. Let's go. Not have to do it one strikeout, but. Alright, the so Wario Greats versus the Yoshi Islanders. Take away hits, but they also give you longer hits. Sometimes they even give you hits out of balls that really shouldn't have been. Even though we have five stars now, I'm gonna let them swing for power. And that was a bad idea. Alright. Also, with five, if you hit it like perfectly, you can get like this automatic home run thing. But, like, the thing is, like, Wabooichi can get that, too, because he's technically a captain. Yeah, only captains could do it. But you have to hit it perfectly, I think. And, yeah. But because this is a star chance, I could use a star. His star is really good. A little bloop into the outfield. Usually it's a hit. And we got the star right back. Okay. We've already got a two-run homer with Kitty Prana. As you notice, he actually had a star mission, hit two home runs in a game, which I actually already cleared in my practice run. So yes, I did get two homers in a game at one point with Kitty Prana, which was awesome. See if we can strike something. Yoshi doesn't really strike out that much. He didn't there. I had a chance to get a big play with the magical catch. I still don't know if that only works for like blue or if it works for their alternates. Damn, we haven't been getting a lot of scout missions, so no wonder we don't have anybody on our team. Mario's team, I don't know if they're good enough to beat Bowser on their own. That's the thing. Like, I don't know. Like the Ma Magic Koopas are not really great players. I gotta be honest. I'm not... Oh, shoot. Okay. At least it wasn't a home run. Like, look at that. Even their... The only thing they're good at is... Good, but Shy Guys are way better at that. Because they have the super dive. But they also... Uh, they're also fast. Like, they're not super fast, but they're pretty fast. You know? Okay. I think I'm just immune to that sound now. I've heard people call it annoying. I'm just... I, I guess I'm just so used to it. Oh, that's gonna be a hit. Nice. Good job, Boo. Got it right in the gap there. Hmm. 
I wonder if I should bump here. I could have probably made that, right so. Could just steal. Oh, yeah. Could have hit and run, but. Mm -mm. If I trust my adult. Well, that. Alright. This is a star chance, so we'll do that. <laughs> so now. Let's legitimately see how well this works. Because it's definitely a thing. Now it's not a thing. Oh, nice catch. Didn't think it was necessary to jump there. But anyway, uh, Yoshi Park. Um, I'm pretty sure all of the stadiums in this game, except for, uh, except for Mario Stadium, you can get stars by hitting the ball in certain places. Like here, I think there's certain... Oh, nice. I, I do love the prime. He has a fast enough arm that a lot of the times it makes up there. Like, you probably didn't think that was going to be an out, but it was. Yeah, there are certain, like, yellow gold piranha plants. I think you can hit it off of them and get a star. Ah, oh, that was a chance to get a jumping catch. We still got a big play, though. Okay, we got power in the lineup now. Wound up at the right time. Kind of just froze me with that one. Alright, come on. Pee Prana has accounted for all of our scoring today. He could have hit that two run home run. Not today, I mean, this game. Oh, wow! Just Yeah, I got a little on the outside of the week, but getting enough power, they just couldn't really get it out. Yeah, you'll notice computers will get perfect hits a lot more than you do, at least more than I do. Um, because yeah, I do. Never mind. That was probably the furthest ball I ever hit with King Boo. Back to back home runs, wow. I mean, that was just perfect. I mean, that's. Yeah, even farther into center. Baby Luigi, just watch that go. Alright, can we get three in a row? Might as well try. I think Magic can put hand hit homers, but it's rare. Well, I'll take it. I haven't read the Piranha Plants come into play yet. They can be kind of fun. I'll do a hit and run. Pretty much the only way that can ever get to third. And even then, it still doesn't work. I should have known. What the hell am I thinking? Oh well. Thought it was gonna have a little kind of scatter more, but it really didn't. Try to hit and run again. You know what? I'm so upset that it didn't work. Whoa! That's like a boomerang shot right there. A Diddy Kong star swing had less spin on it than that. So yeah, home runs, home runs this game. That's what, that's what it's been, that's what the scoring has been for us. Good timing on that jump there, I wish it was King Boo. That could have gotten his mission. Like, I'm not crazy about the star missions, but you know, I like getting them when I can. Like, some of them are hard. Like, for example, Toad and Bowser, you need to do a body check. And I gotta be honest, I don't know how to do that, um, because it's probably because I can't tap the button fast enough, and I still don't know, like, can you only do it at home plate? That's it, that's gonna be in play. Probably it's not worth it, using the magic, the magicalness to get the ball to you. And also, that would've been the last out of the game. I can tell by the lag you want to use the star. Thank you. I don't know if Yoshi could have made it home there. But he didn't try, so we'll never know. I have a lot of stars, so it's... These are just the really curvy ones, right? I just want to get this game done. And it's not going to happen. Luckily, he's able to catch the egg. And because there's not much battery left, it's still a problem. 
He probably was MVP that time, okay. Lava well, Luigi can't hit home run 563. What a batting average. And a 0, 0.00 ERA. I think my battery's about to be out, but. Oh, yeah. I win. I win. Wow. Worst 4 0 victory ever. Okay. Um. Yeah, in the next one, yeah, I'll, I'll try to do this with PD Corona. Okay. I'll try to do it once this episode, and if I don't do it, then I'll just cut to when I do it. Okay. I mean, this is kind of, this can be a fun mini game. It's certainly not my favorite mini game in the game, which is Wall Ball. Um. No, we're on one. Uh, it's been a while since I've done this, so I, okay. To explain this mini game, simply you have to throw the correct colored egg at the correct piranha plant. Um, this is supposed to be a fielding mini game. Like this is probably the mini game that has the least to do with actual baseball. And yeah, the bombs you can throw in. You know. Shoot. Oh yeah, that the purple one you can do. Oh my god, look at the score. This is ridiculous. Well, this is an easy difficulty as well. Yeah, if you throw the wrong one, then it's fire. Like I said, this minigame has the least to do with baseball, but it is kind of like throwing to the right base, like pretend, like let's say you're the catcher, and you're, uh, the yellow. Yeah. Alright, at least I'm not in last now, but the guy this who is in last, Back. Yeah, it's a, it's a base throwing minigame, basically. See, I'll do this off screen. Because honestly, I don't really think this is that exciting of a minigame. I don't really like it. Sorry. 